Whose broad stripes and bright stars Through the perilous fight O'er the ramparts we watched Were so gallantly streaming And the rockets rang <laughs>
Left of his vehicle, the loss of fire, and he's two in front of four. Oh, I saw a clip there. Larry Young's about to lose. And there goes the end one. Mr. Scarborough picks up a lap. And this will really add to the drama. The Orange Crush bounces out the first round. The 81. I'm not seeing anything moving on the orange side. If he can control that machine, he's good to go. Will Steve Scarborough Jr. coming into turn number four. He's going to collect his solo right flag. And what do you know about this? Crazy eights are going to put Orange Crush on the truck early. If you're gambling, man, you're about to lose some money. I don't think anyone saw this. Straight away, 70. 
76. Left the checkered flag. A double upper. But the junkyard dogs are going to go homer. Well, this is certainly turning into a very strange <laughs> Ladies here at the top of the track are right? big arms. 24 on the ground. Are you going to take on the ball? 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 Down the front straight away comes the 43, and I believe he's going to collect the lap. Yes, he did. We're well, one down, four to go. All right. The hit. All right, we're going to take down. Let's see what we can get done in 29 after hitting the wall. It don't look like he's doing much anything. Gave him a good dosey do James Berry there in the 24. Speedy Steve in that station wagon, he loves those wagons. He likes going out there and green building. All right. 43. Comes down the back straight line. Right. That's 29. 29 with a full out of speed. This is the 42. <laughs> 43 in the meantime, he's just on a Sunday stroll. He collects another lap. Three down, two to go. All right, 48. We got three full throttle vehicles rolling around and not a single white one moving. So it's looking like this is just a matter of time. There was just fire inside. 43 comes around. Speedy Steve kind of. Speedy, Speedy Steve is just patrolling. White cars are he doesn't going. like to sit out there and do anything. He's looking for any reason to get somebody. And I guess the number two just got in his way. <laughs> Anthony Hansford, minding his own business there, just got a little bit of 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 a little bit well, hopefully, uh, <laughs> Sean Elder in the 43 finally puts an end to this. Speedy Steve still looking like he wants to do a fireball. It looks like Bill and the Bear are going to be just fine, little Tony. Apparently, there was a huge accident or something. If you watch it live, you can call it. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. You could use the bathroom and stuff like that, so. Fire safety teams out there. So they're going over the tape real quick to make sure everybody's in the right position. Oh, apparently, like they got massive crash and they stopped the race. I right, want to begin to get out there. Steve Lumpur in the 69 and right behind him. Morris to the 30. Now it's Kinson to the lead. Keith Morris also does great in this track. In third place, he looks like the 14. That's Casey Craig. Steve Lampura. Jason Pete Morris. Got a little sloppy there. And he's going to get himself a bit of a lead. Tim Daly to 67. Followed by 64. Driven by John Cook. Three laps down. This is a ten lap affair. Bumping and grinding, going down to seventy seven. Thirty makes it look easy. Thirty just shook the fourteen to the side. Thirty four to go. Thirty four to go. Six to go. Zipping around, 
his straightaway. He's got nothing but open road in front of him. He's doing a great job. But Steve Lampur. This race is halfway over. Wow! Right between the 64 and 67, nicely done. Rock best in the number 11 on the right hand side, and it will be a girl's after the round. The number 14 now being shown in second place is he.
they going to go for it in the end? I believe everybody's going to drive off this time around. Ryan Hoffman in the 11 tried to make a last ditch effort. Machine going there. 
One lap down, four to go. The 87 and the 54 are kind of just pushing against each other. Two laps down, three to go. Poof. <laughs> I'm not sure who's driving the 80. Whoever it is is the person who replaced Dustin Wilson. Oh, wow. That's funny. There comes the collection line number three. There's fire. There's fire. Seems like he still has control of the vehicle. Like. <laughs> Scotty in a 54 is still trying to get that thing started. But it seems like he's firmly attached to the 87 driven by Michaels. White flag racing, the diaper's flying. We just need one more lap, sir. One more lap. Uh oh. Way that 54 is trying to get off the 87. <laughs> Scotty is trying his hardest, but I don't think it's going to happen. Half a lap away from winning here. And for the first time ever, the Crazy Ace are going to the finals. Woo! 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 How about that? Awesome. The Crazy Ace, oh, team crazy. number eight, the black team.
Five second rule. Entering the track. I'm going to read off the numbers and introduce you to all the guys. Look at that Blues Brothers car. See, now that right there is pretty. And the number 172, Michael Lynch from the Oak Forest Police Department. And the number 428, this is the way they're lined up. I'm giving you the order that they're going to line up down front. And the 428, we got Chris Sutherland from Westwood. We got to the number 66, the ladies represented out there with Lindsay. That's a guy? My bad. I better not get too low by me. <laughs> Lindsay, he's Joliet PD too great. He's probably in the parking lot and be waiting for me. <laughs> Billy Alexander from Posen Police Department in a number five. Mike Torrance from the Oswego Police Department is gonna be in a number twenty-six. Steve Olson from the Chicago Police Department in the number 45. Probably has bullet holes on the side. <laughs> Debbie Shank. No, she's a female, right? Okay. She's from the Lockport Police Department in the 95. <laughs> All right, uh, looks like they turned it. Here we go, we are racing. All right, let's see how they handle it. Round and round they go. No, they're not racing. They told me when the fire truck turned the lights off, they were starting with the fireworks. <laughs> Alright, this time around they're going to be racing. Again, this is the 15 lap affair. And it's for bragging rights. Here we go. Coming down out of turn number four. Alright, a little bit of dust on the back straightaway there. And a turn number one. Ooh, look at that nice, a nice power move. Oh, we spat it, spat it. Oh, little bit of wreckage there. Your tax dollars at work. <laughs> wow. Up in front here. That's going to be the number 429 vehicle. And the 429 is, or 428, make that Chris Sutherland from Crestwood. Oh, Crestwood, there we go. <laughs> they roar down the front straight away. We are one lap down. We got 14 to go. Woo! Go ahead and have some All right. <laughs> they kind of bunched up in the back and bunched up on the right. And wow, he's got himself a good lead. The 428 clutch lap number two. All he's got to do is maintain and he'll be just fine. I'm looking at Blues Brothers. You see the bumper on that Blues Brother car? It says, I break for donuts. Go figure. The number seven looking like he's petering out. Uh-oh. Here we got. He's making it look easy. <laughs> well, that's 172 and the 802 502. Well, thinned out kind of nicely. We're 12 laps into it. Twelve laps to go. You know what I was saying. Oh. Yeah, another cheese fry freak. Shut up. <laughs> Kicking up some dust. The boys are doing pretty darn good. Number 66 Blues Brothers car coming down. Probably not very aerodynamic with that speaker on the roof, but nonetheless, he's doing pretty darn good. All pretty spread out. <laughs> the sounds of silence. Down the back straight away. Everybody's playing by the rules. Avoiding that bumperism. <laughs> Kick it up 
Thompson does Jerry Liebmeier. Uh, uh, Liebmeier, by the way. Is that okay? Is he? I can't read your screen. Chicken scratch. It's okay. It was a press Are you okay? Yes. Lamont police in the lead. Round and round, flashing lights. This is pretty darn cool. Maintain. Are they gonna call a caution here on that? No. Yep. Looking like we're getting a caution. Oh. Nope. Good. Let him race. Yep. Yeah, we're getting a caution. Who wants to try? That guy going around the corner in front like. I think they're gonna try and get that bumper off the back straight away is what I think they're gonna do. to go here. Yeah. Chicago PD in the 95 represent. 59 there, the 610. Look at that Blues Brother machine move. <laughs> Nicely done, he slingshots. I don't know how to do that, 
428 is trying to lick you, but watch out. The 89 looking to make a move there. Didn't quite get it done. He had the right idea, but he couldn't pull it off. Oh, never mind. 89 is a lap down, I was just told. Thank you. I'm glad you keep track of that. 428, your race leader pretty much the entire evening. Continues to go with five laps left. We're two-thirds of the way through this. Madsen representing the house there. Let's see, the 80 coming through the midsection there. We got drones flying around. 420, yep, yeah, boom. We are four laps to go, excuse me. 428 grabs himself another lap. Uh oh, looks like someone else is down on the back straight The 232 from Matson Police Department apparently ran into some problems and he's pulled himself off the track. Ooh. That felt so good. Kick it up some dust. Here comes the Blues Brother machine. Three laps away. Spread out pretty good. Here comes the 610. Your race leader, two laps to go. 502, a little banged up there, huh? He goes into turn number one. We're having that big wind scoop on the roof of his car. That's 66 moving pretty quick. Here they come, rolling out of turn number four. 428, gonna pass the 610. Trade a little paint, it looked like. And we got white flag racing. All right, unless something galactically weird happens, here comes your winner. Department. Jerry Lumacher led from pole to finish line. Number 428. His wife wandering in the crowd with his two kids cheering him on.
Lord's field. Good.